Security is more important than ever for virtual events. Whether you're hosting a private event for invited attendees only or a public event, it's important to understand all the security options available with Zoom webinars and events. In this video, we'll look first at securing the registration and join process before looking at all of the tools available once the session is underway. Arguably, the most important security setting when it comes to protecting events is authentication. Authentication helps ensure that only authorized participants are able to attend and that everyone is who they say they are in the event. Zoom webinars and events supports a wide variety of authentication methods for attendees. First, sign in with Zoom. This allows attendees to log in using their Zoom account to register and join. Second, sign in with Zoom or authenticate over email with a one-time passcode. This option allows attendees to use an email address and verify they are who they say they are with a simple and fast one-time passcode that is emailed to them before they can register. Third, external identity providers. The next two options allow event hosts to rely on the authentication profiles that have been set up by their Zoom account admin. These methods are great for internal events. We strongly recommend enabling authentication for all invite-only webinars and events. Finally, hosts can bypass authentication. This allows attendees to provide any email address to register and join. When bypassing authentication, there are a handful of features that will not be available. Most importantly, paid tickets, any registration restrictions, and attendee networking. Once hosts have decided on the appropriate authentication method for the event, they can apply allow or block lists to establish who can view, register for, or join an event. These lists can contain individual email addresses or entire company domains. For the most secure events, hosts can require authentication again at the join process. As you can see, hosts have multiple ways to create a secure registration and join process. They also have a variety of security tools available once the session has started. Let's take a look. First, chat settings can be managed carefully. Hosts can set default chat settings prior to the webinar start from the Meeting and Webinar Settings tab. These settings can be managed from the live session as well here in the chat box. Hosts can allow attendees to chat with everyone, only hosts and panelists, or no one. No one turns off chat for attendees. However, presenters can still use chat to broadcast messages to the audience. Monitoring chat is critical as well, and hosts can delete any unwanted chat messages as needed. Q&A is great for audience interaction, but needs to be secured. Anonymous questions can be completely disabled, and allowing attendees to view answered questions only creates an inbox for the host and presenters to respond to throughout the event. Their response can be made privately or posted for everyone to see. Pro tip, Webinar Backstage is a great place for an event team to monitor chat and Q&A. While backstage, users can freely collaborate and monitor the event while remaining out of sight of the audience. Hosts can also lock or unlock their sessions at any time. Locking the session prevents any new panelists or attendees from joining the session completely. This is perfect for events that are sharing time-sensitive or confidential information. Watermarks display attendee email addresses embedded over their view of shared content or video feeds. This strongly discourages any visual leaks. With all of these preventative measures in place, things can still happen. When they do, removing or reporting disruptive users is simple, right from the participants panel. Did you know that with Zoom webinars and events, hosts can also host meetings with up to 5,000 attendees? The host panel provides quick access to all audience interaction features in meetings. Hosts can manage what the audience members can and cannot do while attending the session. And if needed, all participant activities can be temporarily suspended while the hosts regain control of the meeting. Thank you for watching. Whether you're hosting dozens, hundreds, or thousands of attendees, your event can be secure and run smoothly when using Zoom webinars and events.